This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. But like I tell you every day, the day they release us is false. It meant it gives a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, these AMC bad actors, these AMC criminals, they do not stop. Their numbers are all over the place. They went from a cost of borrow of 82.8% this morning all the way down to 6.6%. 6 so so they don't they don't even know where the shares are coming from. They're just putting out outrageous numbers that make no sense. Let me tell you something. If they found 10 million counterfeit AMC shares to short today. Before the reverse put, that would be a hundred million. Okay, they don't have those shares. They don't have those shares. They are just creating more counterfeit AMC shares in order to manipulate the price, in order to mess with us psychologically. And these cost to borrowers that they're putting on Ortex and these other websites are absolutely false, in my opinion. I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell AMC, but I'm telling you that they don't have these shares. They don't have them. I didn't get all my settlement shares yet, and I'm hearing from a lot of people in the United States and overseas that have not got their settlement shares either. So how are they able to find millions, millions of shares available to short, yet there's a whole bunch of retail investors who have not received their shares yet. So obviously these shares that they are putting out there are counterfeit. So SEC, I know you don't do your job. Well, well, you do do your job, but your job is not to protect retail investors. Your job is to protect the one percenters and help them rob retail investors because the, the evidence of fraud and corruption has been overwhelming for the past 30 months. And they have doubled down on it since the reverse split. They've had all these shares disappear out of thin air. It is the crime of the century in real time. It is the biggest Ponzi scheme in history, in my opinion. And I, a, a illustrious leader, Adam Aaron, has not said a word. That is absolutely outrageous to me. I mean, I've never seen a leader act like this in my life anyway please leave some comments tell me what you think do you think these amc cost to borrow are real do you think they have real shares and if they did don't you think they would have paid retail investors their settlement shares by now anyway have a great day god bless i appreciate y'all on this journey with me